Hey, thanks for checking out the video. Uh, this one's called how to pay off a $17,000 car note in eight months. This is based on a training that I witnessed here myself uh, from one of my mentors whose first business was actually on 60 Minutes. So he definitely knows what he's talking about. And I'm following his lead as well as some other millionaire mentors in this business called My Econ. My Econ is basically a personal financial success company. And uh, we basically teach others how to achieve personal financial success, whatever that means to you, uh, through wealth strategies. And also, uh, also gives you a nice business platform as well that you can use to create some extra income. But I won't get into that right now because that scares people. <laughs> Making money scares people. So uh, let's go into just the training. Um, so you see, I just logged in uh, to my my econ back office, and this is the income shifting membership over here that I just clicked on. And here you see everything that you get inside the membership. The membership is $35 a month. I'll go ahead and put that out there because some people, they won't even pay attention until they know how much this thing costs. But it comes with a smart money kit, which is a credit repair course, also income shifting course. So when I say income shifting, you know that you can actually go here and learn exactly how to shift your income, uh, training videos, documents, how to correctly get that going. But um, here, let's go back. And also, of course, the 750 credit plan, which is our uh, training course. And then you also get the cash flow manager, which we're going to go into. We're going to use the cash flow manager to actually pay that car note off in eight months. And I'll show you exactly how to do that. Uh, ID defender, this identity theft protection, a million dollar policy, key logging defense software. So keeps people from uh, hacking <laughs> into your system and stealing your keystrokes. People don't understand that's really happening out there. We get a legal club, so we get discounts and legal services, not just for criminals, but also for protecting your assets, creating living wills, name changes, and things like that. Uh, tax advice and preparation, cashback mall, and discount travel. All of this stuff is included with that membership, but it's pretty cool. Um, okay, so let's go back into the training here. I'm going to show you this cash flow manager and uh and how it's actually able to help you and how these strategies can help you no matter what your car car note is or even you have a mortgage or something like that but um I'm go right into my training support materials and then down here to where's my cash flow guy here it goes john sample cash flow strategist example so let's go ahead and get that opened up i'm just doing that here there we go So as that opens up, I just want you to think about how free it would feel to not have a car note, how free you would feel to not have a mortgage and things like that. Well, if you understand, you have to get on the right track first. How do you get on the right track? Well, first, you have to understand where you are currently. You can't get better until you're able to measure where you are. You can't increase performance in anything until you're able to measure it. So first of all, we're going to list your top five financial goals with that cash flow manager. And uh, once you have that entered in, then we know exactly what's more most important to you. You know, is paying debts most important to you? Is buying a new home, making a big purchase, increasing your income, saving for college? Which one's most important to you? That way we can help you get on the right path. Two, we're going to help you figure out what is your retirement freedom goal? See, mine's like $10,000 a month because I know, you know, I'm going to be up there living lavish in the places I'm going to be living and things I'm going to be doing. I'm going to need at least 10 k a month. But this, just for an example, let's just say $6,000 a month. And this person plans to retire in 2031, already has $1,500 in retirement income from Social Security and pension, things like that, excluding the 401k. Then we go into the 401k and they have about 15 grand saved up right now. And they currently invest about a hundred dollars a month into the savings, and they think they can actually increase that by a hundred and fifty dollars a month by adding additional uh, money into that. And in this example, how much money do you have set aside for emergencies? You need at least six months of worth of living expenses. In this example, we have two thousand dollars set aside for emergencies. Uh, do you feel current? Do you feel you currently have a plan in place to accomplish your retirement goal? Yes or no? And only 20% of people are going to actually choose yes. So that lets us know that there's a huge opportunity out there for everybody that's watching this video. Uh, then we're going to get into the number three, which is the debt elimination section. You're going to have put down what is the debt that you have right now. Don't be afraid of the elephant in the room. I know I was afraid to just go ahead and list down, you know, all the credit cards, all the debt that I have, the student loans. But you have to start facing this information and t if you think that you're ever going to beat it, 
You know, you can't beat something if you keep running away from it. So <laughs> we'll go ahead and put down your credit card, your car payment. See, in this example, $17,000 in the car note is five forty-five a month. All right. So then we're going to go down to reoccurring monthly expenses. You got to be able to cut these things because you can't pay off a cell phone bill. You can't pay off utilities. You can't pay off cable. I guess you can pay off life insurance when you pass away. But some of these things you have to learn how to cut them down cell phone bill you don't need all that data you don't need all those minutes sometimes utilities you don't need to you know use uh, electricity during the nighttime hours when you're leaving when you're away from work turn the ac off all kinds of different things that you can do to reduce your utility bills uh cable bill do you really watch all that tv like i've actually cut cable out i don't have cable coming in my house you know all i have is wi-fi and then i use fire stick you know, your streaming services, been able to cut my cable bill down significantly. But you have to start thinking about these things. Like we're forking over all this money to the cable company, but you're paying more to the cable company than you're paying to your, your future retirement fund. Think about that. So in this example, we're going to be able to go ahead and cut down some of these expenses. And as you can see, it went from 95 to 60 on the cell phone bill, from 400 to 300 in utilities, 750 um, seven, excuse me, $175 a month on the cable down to $85. That's exactly what mine was. Um, and life insurance from $325, get rid of that whole life policy guys. Like whole life is good. If you're really, um, thinking about building that as an asset, but you really just want term life, cut that down and save some money with that. Uh, eating out is huge. It's huge for us in my, in my household, Cutting down that budget has helped significantly, uh, but overall, we're going to cut down on a lot of our expenses, and we're going get to get our freedom goal in mind now. So this right here is the second page. It's basically our second stage. It's going to list out exactly uh, a good plan for you. Okay, so here's some goals. Retirement goal here is $6,000 a month. Remember that. Uh, we think that we're going to have $1,500. Okay, we got that uh, coming in monthly from pensions. Uh, projected net amount needed to um, reach the goal. So you have already 1500 of it, but you want 6000 So we need an extra $4,500 a month. So how do we come up with an asset that can generate $4,500 a month? Well, we need to have $675,000 in the bank earning an interest of 8%. Okay? So I know that scares a lot of people. Like, wow, I'm way off my goal. <laughs> well, that's the purpose. That's the point in looking at this. But I want you to know right now this is totally achievable and with these strategies that I'm getting ready to go over here in the next two minutes. Now, the projected value of assets owned today. This is what you have right now, that $15,000 in that 401k. Uh, growing at uh, at eight percent, that is expected to balloon out to forty nine thousand dollars. So that's good. So what's the difference between what you need and what you already have? Is six hundred and twenty five thousand dollars. So we're going to need six hundred and twenty five thousand dollars. That's the actual asset that we're going to need to create. Monthly amount needed for investments to build this retirement freedom goal: eighteen hundred dollars. Now, if you think about it, that's not too bad. I mean, you're talking about $1,800 a month to be able to create an asset of $625,000 that's able to give you $6,000 a month when you retire. Well, actually, it's $4,500 a month, plus what you're already getting, which is $1,500, to reach that $6,000 uh, goal that you want to have when you retire. Listen, if you're not working towards your retirement right now, somebody's going to be working to take care of you. And that's not fair. That's selfish. Okay. So if all you have to do is create $1,800 and put that aside, then let's get to the business. Let's, let's start learning how to do that. So you're already putting in a hundred dollars a month right now. So all you really need is $1,700. All right. See how the numbers are flowing there. Let's keep going. This is starting to get fun, right? So with this, with how do we create that $1,700 every month? The first thing is to create a business income. You know, you already have work. What else can you do but create a system that can bring money to you? Okay, in this example, we're just saying that you're able to earn an extra $500 a month by sharing these wealth strategies with other people. And it really doesn't take too many people to start duplicating this before you can create a, res a serious residual income. We're just going to save $500. All right. 
And then with the taxes and withholding strategy, this is really the step two is really where everybody's going to be able to to participate. Not everybody can come in here and create business income right here, but everybody that has a job is going to be able to create at least two hundred to five hundred dollars a month in shifting their income. Income shifting challenge. Look that up. <laughs> and actually, I'll show I'll show you that when we get now. Actually, I'll show you that, I'll show you that now because I, I think people are so they're skeptical about this right here. This is free money that's just sitting right now in your paycheck. Let me hop on over to the book. You know, the fake book. <laughs> but this is real life stuff right here. So I just put in a hashtag income shifting challenge. Look, seventeen hours ago. So this is really current information. Um, Income shifting challenge. If you're income shifting, drop some results in the comments. So let's see what kind of comments that we can come up with. This person, $150 every two weeks equal a $300 raise in my paycheck, no overtime. Let's zoom in so we can really see what he's talking about there. See the highlighted area right there. He was having $184 taken out of his taxes, now only $34. How is that possible? Easy. We'll show you how to do it, but you have to be a member. <laughs> All right. How about this right here? <clears throat> taxes 471 now only 127 it's incredible look at this one $640 a month back in his paycheck without asking the boss for a raise I know you can't see it but it's down here towards the bottom this is incredible like you mean to tell me that all these years I've been working, I, I really could have extra money in my uh, in my paycheck. You know, you've been working overtime, been putting in, you know, all these trying to get a raise, trying to get a promotion, and things like that. And all I had to do was ten minutes worth of paperwork. <laughs> all right, so let's get let's get into it here. <clears throat> so with adjusting your monthly expenses, with shifting your income, with earning an extra five hundred dollars a month in the business alone you're able to get an additional seven hundred dollars a month excuse me seventeen hundred dollars a month here it goes right here all right so seventeen hundred dollars a month is what you're able to come up with now guess what you apply that to your car payment this five hundred and forty five dollar car payment your new monthly car payment is twenty two hundred dollars and you didn't even work any extra overtime you basically just cut your expenses, you increased your paycheck with the income shifting strategy that we show you, and now you're able to terminate that car payment in eight months, and you have an additional $2,200 left over that you can use that for the next thing, which actually the next thing right here is this credit card. You know, let's say you have an $8,000 credit card. You were paying $200 a month. Now go ahead and use this um two thousand dollars that you have saved from this car payment now you're able to eliminate that in four months and then you talk about your mortgage just a two hundred thousand dollar mortgage you were paying twelve hundred dollars a month now since you freed up all this extra money from these steps up here these first two debts you're able to now apply thirty six hundred dollars and you're able to terminate that debt in fifty five months so we'll say fifty five months divided by twelve four and a half years you are debt free and you have three thousand dollars a month thirty six hundred dollars a month to spend on investing remember you only needed seventeen hundred dollars just to invest to create to to reach your freedom goal right well now you have thirty six hundred dollars a month after four months of being excuse me after about four to five years of being in this company now you generated an extra three thousand dollars a month and you're not going to take that and go party and go buy expensive stuff with it. No, you're going to take that and dump it into your investment account and watch how it will grow. By the year 2051, you're sitting at $5.9 million, all from just shifting your, your income starting today. But uh, this wasn't meant to be a long video, so I'll go ahead and cut it short there. I do want everybody to understand, like, listen, I mean, we're we're really here to help people. We're not here to try to, you know, make a quick buck or anything. And if you want to reach out to me, I'm a real person, man. You know, I'm I'm out here in Wilmington, North Carolina. You, I really want y'all to to either um, just find me on Facebook. Just look up Jerry Goins. If you're already one of my friends, if you're if I've sent you this video personally, then get in touch with me. We're only talking about a thirty-five dollar decision. You have thirty-five dollars in one hand, and you have seventeen hundred dollars in the other hand. Which one are you going to give up? Because right now, by you holding on to this thirty-five dollars, you're foregoing the seventeen hundred dollar benefit. 
you know. So I want y'all to really think about that and put it in perspective. Listen, where do you want to be in the next five years? Where do you want to be in the next 10 years? Get with us or get left. <laughs> I hate to say it like that, but get with us or get left. Let's go. AssetClass101.com.